Brothers skate. Restart, restart. Okay. That was me more up. Okay, okay. Hi guys, I'm Noah. And I'm Beckett here from Watson Brothers Skate. And today we are bringing you a review on the Rain Savage. A new board from Rain Longboards. This board comes in at a length 37 inches with a width of 10 inches and has wheelbase options from 26 and a quarter all the way out to 28 and a half. The all new Rain Savage has a lot of new like features that make it better and make it stand out from a lot of other boards. The first thing that's great about it is that it has sharp edges with future feet locked in. Yeah, your feet won't be slipping around when you're doing free ride or anything like that. Uh, the second good thing about this board is that it is symmetrical and comes in a twin shape. So you can choose whether you want to, which direction you want to ride it, you're never stuck riding one direction. Yeah, you're not limited to that. I mean, the graphics kind of indicates front and back, but the concave and everything is all symmetrical, so you can ride it any way you want. Also, this board has Rain's back bottom concave, which means that in the center of the board, it starts off thick, and as it, um, no, in the center of the board, it starts off thick, and as it tapers to the edges, it gets thinner, so that Mostly it takes off weight of the board and it looks pretty cool. Also it has a bamboo core and it just makes it super stiff and there, there won't be any flex in this board. So it's perfect for downhill and free ride. No, hey, Hayden, please stop. Don't take down the window. Thank you. This board has... Okay. The Brain Savage has a supplemented graphic, meaning that the board is tattooed in to the graphic. Into the graphic, basically. <laughs> you said so, the board is tattooed into the graphic. The graphic is tattooed into the board, meaning you won't get any of those nasty scratches and crap all over your dot. And it's nice and clean, always looking brand new. Makes the graphic last longer, and it looks pretty cool. So that's a, that's a plus. It increases the lifespan of the board. All right. Another cool thing about this board is the concave. Got a lot of nice concave on it. Oh. And there's a lot of leaves. Hey, Mom. Can I be on? No. Yeah, okay. of course. <laughs> <laughs> okay, so the con some of the concave included in this board. Alright, so I'm just gonna read it straight up off the website, but it, it has a concave called beverage concave and it grips from the ball of your foot to the center of the heel for outstanding turn control. Yes, and also like my brother said before my mom came in, it has some nice uh, W running down the center of the board. It's perfect for all your toe side, heel side, tucking knees. You'll know where your feet are. And um, you probably, you can't see this, but the W, it starts off really thick in the middle and kind of, kind of goes down as Wait, wait. You get closer to the truck, so by the truck there's no W anymore. Yeah, and, um, yeah, there's not really any W where your feet go, but it's still, it, it, it has enough so that it locks you in when you're doing toe sides and heel sides. Also, when you're tucking, it kind of gives you a reference where to put your feet, so that's always nice. No. But it is. Okay. Oh, okay. Well, another good... Wait, where's the wheel up? 3D wheel wells. Okay, another thing about this board is that it has 3D wheel wells, which means something. It means yeah. that so you can ride like bigger wheels and yes. give you more wheel clearance. You have some nice wheel flares going on here, so you won't be getting any wheel bite or anything. We have about two, two and a half inches of clearance riding 70 millimeter wheels on here. So you don't need to worry about getting wheel light or anything like that. You can run some pretty big wheels on this board. Also, uh, I re-drilled it, so if you're gonna rock like really big wheel wheels on the re-drilled wheelbase, it has more of a chance of getting wheel light. But if you're rocking it on the outer wheelbase, then there's no chance whatsoever of getting wheel light because there's not really any board in, like on top of where your wheels are. So you don't have to worry about that. And I kind of re-drilled it because it's better for free ride. So usually when you're free riding you're rocking smaller wheels so you're not gonna have to worry about wheel bite or anything. So that's one great thing about this board. Okay. Also as you can see this board comes top mount which makes it a you can't tell. It. But it comes top mount so that makes it great for free ride and I don't know, I just like top mount boards in general. Um, 
Yeah, and also, don't let the website throw you off when it says, smells good, comma, tastes great, comma, feels and protects your war with, from harmful chemicals. It does not smell good. We haven't tasted it yet, but I don't know. Yeah, it smells like wood. Uh, the orange blood, orange wheel. Wow, review coming good. Alright guys, so this is another review by Noah and Beckett Watson. Uh, I'm Rand Savage. I hope you enjoyed, and if you liked it, make sure to leave a like. And subscribe if you aren't already. If you have any further comments or questions about this board, make sure you just leave a comment down below and we'll try to answer it. Um, also, Skate safe. Wear a helmet, wear pads, wear gloves. Yeah, wear gloves. Because <laughs> I don't wear gloves. Um, and yeah, this is all has for a good holiday. Happy New Year's. Happy, yeah, happy, uh, happy January. Hopefully, what's the next holiday? Thanks. Happy oh. Valentine's Day. <laughs> that's another one, right? That's, yeah, that's yeah. February 16th. Sure. It might be. Thank you.